Welcome back all. So here we are with a new app that is Instagram Clone. So this app is pretty amazing and it actually serves all the features of Instagram. Mostly it covers all the features of Instagram. So let's see the demo of this application and then we'll start creating. So here we can see Instagram, login or sign up to continue and even there are terms and conditions. So we can see note. Instagram legally disclaims the products and all the this is showing the terms and conditions. So let's see login or sign up to continue. Where is saying enter mobile number as well as password. So we we'll enter our mobile number and enter password. Edula. Next, enter name, of course, a dealer, and enter username, of course, a dealer. Then, next, then it's showing enter bio. So, here we will write YouTuber. And love coding. Next, we have to upload our profile picture. So we will upload it. Edula, upload it. Now let's click on see pic. So here we can see the pic which we have uploaded. Now click on login. So here we can see that creating Edula. So now if I click on see other post. Then I can see the other post which my friends have posted and even I can like this post. See isn't it so fun liking the post. Right now we can even go back and click on camera to upload our own post. I mean our own post. I am uploading my profile picture only for now. And now it's uploaded what else. So we will go to profile. And here we can see all our posts. So these are the posts I posted before. And like it's not posted. It's all like Instagram I show. Like we commented we can say. And here is my post which I have posted right now. And here is my name reflected. So this is the app which we are creating today. I know this is very much similar to Instagram. And it has many features of Instagram like liking the post. Then sharing post. And then. Seeing other posts, creating accounts, and all that stuff. So when I go to home, it's the same here. So let's start creating it. Let's start with creating a new app lab project. Fine. Now, as always, we always do designing the screens first, right? So. Let's import our screens. So the link of this app is available to in description. Please import it here so that we can save our time by designing. But still, if you are not having the link or some any reason, any reason, then I'm explaining you each and every screen so that you can create each and every screen. So the, I will delete this screen one and screen entry. This is the screen entry and here. Button login or sign in to continue. One pick of Instagram, then one note of terms and conditions. So then we have this is the note terms and conditions button. This you can get in internet and then click on that. Then screen home. This is the home label image. Button, 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 theater post, and these all are actually the icons. And how did we do the icons? Just click on. Okay. And this is actually not an icon, this is photo select component. Here we have inserted images, and the images links are available to you in the description. Then we have go to screen login. So this is login screen. So here spelling is wrong. We can cut it. Login or sign up to continue. Enter mobile number. Then 
text input and same for password and next button as Instagram load. Then we have screen login view here enter me and so you see and everything was see. Okay. Then we have login screen 3 and here the same you can duplicate it and do the required changes like enter bio, the text input, then one photo select option, then one image, click on cpic and this will be hidden, we will do while we are coding the app. Then screen new this I have already shown you, then the screen post, so here the post would be, so, so here what all you have to do, you have to add a back button here, one Instagram logo, then here you have to add the name of the ID. Then here image, then here these all assets and these are available in the description, these assets and you will actually get all these assets by going here, clicking on image, go to icons and here you will get all these icons like of the heart shape icon, liking icon and all this stuff you are going to get it. I hope all is clear and if you are having any difficulty Finding anything, you can always let me know in the comment section. Even you can join our Discord server, and even you can ask me in my mail ID, and which is provided there official dot at direct gmail dot com. Even Discord server, as I have already told you, and then we have our Discord server. So this is the heart shape icon. These two, okay. Don't worry, the assets are also given in description, so you don't need to always. Then we have screen profile. In screen profile, we have one button. We have here number, followers, following. Here we have one button to just distinguish both of them to divide the screen. One back button, and these are the posts. And this is one simple image, this is not defined, and this is going to be defined when the user uploads any of his post. Then one button here. So then all done. Let's go to code and start coding our app. So here we are. So we are doing that on event when this on event when let me do it more. So on event when button number Two is click when it's going to show them screen no. Now when button number one is click, then what's going to happen? Sorry, here it's not screen two, it's screen no. Now on event when screen button number 1 is clicked, then what's going to happen? Then it's going to set screen number Sorry Screen number login. Let's try testing. Login or sign in. Yes, it's showing. Then when note. Okay. Now we're going to do for the rest of our patterns also. So we have button number nine. When button number nine is clicked, then it's going to set screen login to. And when button number thirteen, it's there in. So login number 2 here when button number 13 is click and it will be set screen number login 3 and when button number 13 here so when sorry button number 18 is click this is button number 18 is C pick then what's going to happen then it's going to
12 So, on in the middle of our 18 is then it's going to set the image URL here of 6 as get image URL. Okay. And on even in button number 17 is to extend what's going to happen. The on even in version number 17 is to it. If it's like screen screen mode and on even to in both photo select to its input function, it will set the image URL of image 8 as split image. So this image number 8 is there. This image number is it from photo select you. So now on event when this button number here in level 3 when this button number 19 is 6 12 is second. I'm checking something. It's used that for now. So when button 19 is made, then it's going to set screen number profile. So this screen is going to be set. Screen profile. Um, so this is actually this button number 19 profile. This is the button. And it will set the image URL of image number 15. Image number 15, if you set this URL to fit the image of photo select and set text of button 24 as text, get text this name and set screen screen for when button number 31 is click this button. And when button number 27 is clicked, then it's going to set screen post. So this button number 17 is this button, button number 17. Well, so when the button number 27 is sorry when this button 27 is clicked then it's going to set then screen post and when button number 34 is clicked then this when when this button is clicked then it's going to set the property of this color as black and it's going to play the sound of hum. So the sound is actually of modification. Let me show you. So you can search for category bell notification for this one to so click yes. So we just click this out. You can choose. Okay, so this is how we are doing. You can go to show text again. 
and here the button number 35 also we will do the same just copy it paste it for button number 35 Now let's do for button number 36 and 37. This is 37 and this is 36. So when these four buttons are clicked, then it's going to set the icon color as green and the same. It's going to show the sound as default sound. And when button number when button number 38 and 39, these buttons, music button is used, then it's going to show them a sound which is birthday, cat, move. This sound, let me show you how. Click here. Birthday, cat, so like this you can choose any other sound here the sound which we are choosing is for the game key ok now on event when button number 30 this button is clicked then it's going to set screen number 1 so with this, our app is made.